If the whole get your essentials basic hasn't been working for you because then you just stare at your closet and say you have nothing to wear, then throw out the concept. So par example, these babies, these are urban outfitters. The minute I opened the box, I saw a hundred different outfits I could do. To me, that's a basic. Got this little cami on Amazon. It's just a great underpinning. Okay, I love these shoes with the culottes. Elsa Peretti bottles, thank you very much. And yet another, do we dare do a third? No, too much. No one to pull back. The shoes way down the whole delicacy of the look. I love the clean nothing in the ears against the Peretti accoutrement, but I'm definitely getting cold. A linen blazer in a transitional color. This one was Zara earlier in the season because it's always air conditioned. I love the length of this one. You don't know where my bum starts or stops, so it just lengthens my leg. And there's a chic nonchalance about the whole look now. And at the end of the whole thing, let's throw in a weird, unexpected clutch. Okay, maybe this J. Crew sweater is a basic because I keep buying the same one over and over again every season. We've all been wearing sweatpants this whole time. So like, why are we so quick to get out of them? Very chic. Okay, I like the idea of these cream pearls filling up the neck space a little bit. It almost gives it a turtleneck feel without it being a turtle. I want a little waist definition. When you're wearing sweatpants, sometimes you can lose your waist and a really fun and easy way to find it again is with a good fitted blazer. This one's Max Mara Weekend. Okay, what should we do for a bag? Yeah, for the bag, I kind of like the idea of the sporty crossbody that pick up on the athletic pants, but juxtapose against all the pearl and cream going on. So in conclusion, these puppies, are definitely a basic.